So, what we've learned is that we're idiots and that we've accidentally missed out on a bunch of stuff. So, first things first, we're going to travel as a group to Fastbard where we have a recruitment opportunity. Grab more firepower. Cobb has come into possession of a powerful artifact. I'm probably going to skip all the stuff at the north that I should have done in Chapter 2, just to make this doable. Oh, wandering stranger, come hide from the moon. The barrels are full and fiddles in tune. Come ask the barkeep for a bow, cup, and spoon. We'll dance you to sleep or we'll drink until noon. Sorry, I was just, uh, the chorus is better. Rolling through glances at a gleam. Cobb realizes the dagger in his hand is flashing with the mixed light of moon and fire. Oh, it's nothing. It's... It's got the mark of Old Wayne. Though he clutches it away, his friend has already gotten a good look. It's too late to deny it. The vision of the blade, once beholden, can never be forgotten. Loitha... The... Oh, crap, that doesn't look good. The rippling edge is oddly arresting. The Old Wayne family's grim crest glares, graven into the hood. I didn't mean to let you see it, but what I intend seems to weigh little in its gravity. It's just an old butter cleaver. My dead friend left it to me. The weird thing about it, it could probably unspool creation. What? According to legend, this weapon, the Oath of Old Wayne, was made by the last persecuted Old Wayne mystic. It was made for vengeance, to cause suffering. It ruined a whole age of our land, shattered what generations had built. So now, I need to make sure that doesn't happen again. That's where we're headed, isn't it? To destroy that thing? Do you still intend to come along? I know it's dangerous. I intended to slip away once we got close. Uh, let's do it. Apparently the dire destiny is spoken. You're not scaring me off, Cobb. Sounds like you need a friend. I will take... I'll take Pamino, which is her son, and we will venture differently. Cobb and Luther. Cobb leads Luther into the ancestral land of the Old Wayne family. The Old Wayne legend is a rich well of villains for Roost Thor and storytellers, a group of questionably related kinsfolk living in a secluded manner practicing dark crafts. It had to be in a swamp, didn't it? No wonder these people were so morbid. Come on, better if we stick close. It's a frog turtle. Bah? <laughs> Can he join? He's cool. This looks like it was a guardhouse, maybe. Look at the thickness of the stones. Must be close. Soon they're within a proper ruin, with towers half sunk and many of them tumbled. We're looking for a forge? There's a stairwell. And there you go. You sure this is right? This is how you unmake the thing? Here, take the torch. As Cobb draws the dagger, the oath of Old Wing, the eyes over the forge begin to glow. The forge rolls awake, vomiting hot coals. But like the dagger itself, the glowing embers arrest his eyes. And then he sees two figures in the flames. In one, he sees himself aged and alone, still fighting the same, losing battles he's embroiled in today. In the other, he's not much older than he is now. He used the power in the dagger to bring peace to those he loves. Perhaps he should wield it. It would change him, but not immediately. In the meantime, think of all the good he could accomplish for his friends and for this world. And what's to stop him from destroying it later, right? Well... Die of Destiny! Yeah, no, this thing's going in the fire. Don't, yeah, it's got a scope. No way it's good. The dagger melts the forge and instantly melts. The coals jump and fly. Frigid air fills the room, snuffs the torch. And then, an apparition takes shape. Is it truly done? You cast away that cursed blade of mine? Yours? The spirit resolves into the form of a woman. Oh, she's got a skeleton hand. I made it in vengeance to punish the world that persecuted my family. 
so rashly done? You regret it, you mean? The anger was cold in me long before the blood stopped running. But I'd set it in motion. Someone else would need to end it. I can't answer for all the pain it's caused. But to you, at least. The glow that surrounds the last Old Wayne Mystic flares brightly for a moment. And she's gone. Where she stood lies what looks to be a bolt of fabric. At a second glance, it's a cloak of ghostly weave. Carl bends and picks it up. You sure you want to touch that? Just got through destroying an evil artifact, didn't we? This feels different. Grog! A bestial bellow echoes down the stairwell. Yeah, we know. Let's go kill it. I got the Atonement of Old Wayne. A mantle of hope and virtue. So good against warding, bonus damage, and potency. So definitely Cobb. What Cobb is just... Cobb is looking amazing, guys. But we do have a mission now. So we're going to have to do this. The Mushrocks. Uh, okay, so... Uh, we have Splinter Bass. Let's try that. Let's see if we can pin this thing in place. Yep. Okay, that's excellent. Uh, I need to swap my weapon first of all so I can just... Yeah, let's get behind some cover. And... Oh, it replaces his regular attack. That's cool. very large creature, so let's see if we can just keep on keeping on. Yeah, I have no problem doing this to enemies, by the way. Now a bronze horn warrior gains adjacent allies bonus damage and spell damage. Tinkerer, upgrade, shooting star, one base damage, scales twice as much with, yeah, let's upgrade her shooting star. The stone flint belt, which is potency. He's the, really the only one who has magic damage, so. They leave the old Wayne estate behind to sink into the obliterating muck of time. You good? I'll be fine, just feeling sorry for, just all the suffering that gets buried in the stories we tell the ones we don't. He looks awesome, by the way. It will be a while before they feel like talking again, but not so long. And by the morning of their return, they'll carry peace in their hearts. Oh, she's singing again. Cobb Ever is now a blue horn mystic and gained retirement age. So I can upgrade Compulsion, gets a bonus to all campaign level tasks based on his age. Cobb reduces the stunt the cost of recruits by one, plus five stunt. That's amazing, so I'm going to take that. Why did you all go here, anyway? I'll go around through this and get all that stuff so that we can try to so Mac we'll let Mac prepare a defense just in case while they're recruiting I got a hot-headed romantic. I'm, can I? Knights of Whitehammer has reached Fastbald. I've been waiting my whole life for this opportunity. 
Well, we haven't been around that long, but if you want, I could sign your, uh... Huh? Listen, when I told you that my mother was a renowned cowherd, not because she was good with cattle, what if I owe, but because she beat a bull god in combat and won her good fortune? And then Grandma. Legend is she threatened to flood so severely that it turned on its tail before it reached Fastbard. Which is why the town continues to be known for its unmatched magical artifact museum. I think I've heard that story. The point is, my blood is the blood of exceptional people. You know what kind of pleasure comes with that? Pressure, and, excuse me, and so I've been searching for a chance, any chance, to snag some renown of my own. Let me join you. Right then, let's see if we can't channel that heal juice into something useful. Uh, I have two warriors and I have two, so let's just make her a mystic. Uh, I kind of wish it would, like, randomly do that, but, uh... So yeah, prepare you her ready. And then finish that. Okay, so first off, she's now a Greenhorn Mystic. So I can't, I can't increase her infusions. She can bond with the earth and some seedlings that sort of... That is cool. I want to try that. Okay, so, man, the Knights of Whitehammer are awesome, by the way. So here's the deal. First, we need to scout here. I'm going to take you fought, not you. You're going to stay with Mac. And instead, I'm going to send Loretha. Okay. You five will go here. And for here... She does at least have tier one. Okay, I can give her a tier two staff, which I'm going to do. And Mac is going to make a uh, tier two defense. Oh, I can't go that way. Oops. Okay, so here, gather. Let's send you guys to here. And if we need to, they can be a good reaction force. I like having so many heroes. We'll probably have more if I had, you know, screwed up everything, but oh well. The enemy's plans, however, will increase soon. Because that timer right there. Slim Force has been revealed. Let's patrol this down. Oh, damn. Uh, I don't want 20... I've only got enough... I'm going to cancel your damage. I'm going to cancel your health. I'm out of legacy points, unfortunately. Haven't faced any of these guys well yet, but I don't seem to be in conflict with them. We're going to prepare tier 2 defenses here so that they're doing stuff. Oh no! Feynman and Premier don't like each other, but we have cleared the infestation. Attack! I have to be honest, I'm glad it's you cooking tonight. My feet are so tired that my hands are starting to feel it. Don't get too excited. Huh? So we'll hit day fast forge tomorrow morning. That detour added more time than we thought it would, and our food is running a little low. How low? I've got onions and... some more onions. I thought there was still jerky. I figured we'd need that tomorrow. Aww. Onions on a meal? They're an ingredient. I bet I could get us a fish. I bet I can change it. I'll go with Cobb, because neither one of them is a great chance, but let's see what happens. A good onion soup can hold its own against any other meal. Low and slow, that's the key. How slow? Start thinking of stories now. Aww. Later, the version they tell in Slim Force differs in one key way, you see, because of the agricultural significance of the... even later. And I was astounded, there it was in the original document. 
even later than that. So, how much longer, you think? Ugh, they're not doing what I wanted them to do. I'm not sure if it's salvageable at this point. Sorry about the onion mush. No, it's good. It's, um... Okay, you're right. It's disgusting. Thanks for trying. We have Geist, Bogmoors, Rages, Raccoons, and Rogues. So I guess I didn't get a bonus for the... Okay, let's, uh... Let's stack everything up. Why do I... I have three rangers. Fineland, open the door, buddy. Wow! Hi! Took cover. Yeah, he's blocking the, uh... I can only see the step ladder, so I've got a splinter blast, but that'll work. Did shred his armor. Damn it. But my armor at least held. What the hell was that? Ow. Oh, crap. Okay. Well. First off, Oni. Swap your weapon and then hit him. There you go. Oh, come on! Don't make me... S Don't stop on go golden corrupted land, it's not good. Right, let's go here. Let's go here. There's definitely something there. Hi. Oh, he blocked that. Well, that's bad. Oni, you need to stack up with her. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, yeah, watch this. Oh, wait, no, I thought that was the, uh... Shoot. Yeah, you make me one. Oh, he got him! I think I can discus. Uh... I cannot. So let's do aid and let's give Ani some hit points. There you go. Nope. So Cobb, discus this thing. Uh. Can you shoot? Anyone got shot? Go. Oh, was that all of them? Necklace of Chivalry, plus 5 armor. Who's got the lowest armor? 1.4. 5. Macro retire at the end of this chapter. It's the last chapter, it's only a 3 chapter story, so it doesn't matter. 1.4. 1.4. 1.9. 1.8. 4.1. 4.2. 4.3. 4.4. 4.5. 4.6. 4.7. 4.8. 4.9. 4.10. 4.11. 4.12. 4.13. 4.14. 4.15. 4
Oh, well, there's no point in securing anything because there's you don't get anything at the end of the chapter. So, first things first. You need to go to a town. Building a bridge. Right now. Oh, well, one hit point means that he heals pretty quick. There we go. Now we can get to fastball to heal really quickly. Scout. They've arrived at Fast Forge. Three. Can I. How do I develop this? It's not letting me develop. Let me send. Okay, back. What should the two of you do? You can't defend this. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna send you two here and we're going to. That's the closest city. So we need to have it tier 3 as much as possible. There you go. Let's patrol this sucker. Oh no, it's an incursion. Gorgons, a great number, move to attack our hollow lands. Driving peaceful folks before them, leveling homes and hollow places. Your heroes will travel, your enemies will travel, and okay. How, how does this work? They're going to roost. Damn, they're 44 days away. So guys, we are both attacking and defending now. This is actually a good place to stop the video. We are going to have to figure out what the hell we're going to do next time. And a tile floods in 41 days. I'll see you then.